Have you ever wondered about the beauty standards of ancient Egypt, a civilization renowned for its advanced beauty rituals? Well, prepare for a journey back in time around 1500 BC to a period where beauty had a different face, quite literally. In this era, an intriguing symbol of feminine beauty was a shaved head, a beauty standard that, to us, may seem incredibly unique, even eccentric. The women of ancient Egypt were not just shaving their heads on a whim. This was a meticulously maintained ritual, a testament to their dedication to beauty. They used special gold tweezers, a luxury in itself, to remove every single hair from their heads, striving for that perfectly smooth scalp, and it didn't stop there. Post-tweezing, the women would polish their scalps to a high sheen using buffing cloths. Imagine the diligence and commitment required to uphold this beauty standard, but why, you may ask, was a bald head considered the epitome of beauty? We can't say for certain, but there are a few theories. One is that a shaved head was a practical solution to the sweltering Egyptian heat. Another suggests that it was a symbol of cleanliness and purity, as lice and other pests were a common problem. Yet another theory proposes that it was a mark of status, with the gold tweezers signifying wealth and privilege. Whatever the reasons, this beauty trend was deeply entrenched in the societal and cultural fabric of ancient Egypt. There's also a powerful lesson to be learned from this. Beauty is not static, it is fluid, ever-changing, influenced by myriad factors from climate to social status. It's a reminder that beauty is in the eye of the beholder and there's no one-size-fits-all standard. While it may seem unusual to us, the bald head was a symbol of beauty and elegance in ancient Egypt. Now, let's transition from the polished scalps of ancient Egypt to the diverse beauty standards of the modern world. Imagine a time when a shiny, hairless head was the epitome of beauty. That was the reality in ancient Egypt, where women would meticulously pluck every hair from their heads using gold tweezers and buff their scalps to a high sheen. Fast forward to today, and it's clear that beauty standards have undergone a significant transformation. Over the centuries, societal norms and cultural influences have shaped and reshaped our perception of beauty. From the full-figured silhouettes of the Renaissance period, revered as a sign of prosperity, to the slender, waif-like figures popularized in the 20th century, the ideal body type has continually evolved. Similarly, our perception of facial beauty has shifted dramatically. In the Victorian era, a pale complexion was highly coveted, indicating a life of leisure, free from outdoor labor. Contrastingly, in today's society, a sun-kissed glow is often desired, suggesting an active and adventurous lifestyle. But it's not just about the physical anymore. The 21st century has seen a shift towards celebrating inner beauty, with qualities such as kindness, intelligence and confidence becoming increasingly important. Today, beauty is about expressing individuality and embracing one's unique features. We've also seen a move towards inclusivity and beauty standards. More than ever, different skin tones, body shapes and ages are being celebrated. The rise of social media has played a crucial role here, giving a platform to a diverse range of voices and images challenging the traditional ideal. The beauty industry too has had to adapt, with brands now offering a wider range of products to cater to this diverse market. Diversity is no longer a trend, it's a necessity. However, it's essential to remember that beauty standards are continually evolving, influenced by societal changes, cultural shifts and technological advances. What's considered beautiful today may not hold the same status tomorrow. As we can see, beauty standards have come a long way since the days of ancient Egypt, embracing a wider range of looks and styles. Now take a moment to reflect on these contrasting beauty standards. It's fascinating, isn't it, how our perception of beauty has evolved over the centuries? From the polished, bald heads of the ancient Egyptian women to the myriad of styles and looks we celebrate today, it's clear that beauty is not a fixed concept, but one that shifts with time and culture. Consider this transformation. What influences have led to these changes? Is it societal values, media, or perhaps personal preference? It's interesting to ponder how our modern standards are shaped by a complex mix of these factors and more. And what about the future? Will our current ideals remain or will they morph into something entirely new? It's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? But always remember this, beauty is subjective and ever-changing. It's a reflection of individuality and personal style. Embrace your unique beauty and remember, all women are beautiful.